Hello Puppet fans! And welcome to this lecture. In this lecture we will learn about the Puppet Enterprise, and Puppet Master Agent Setup. As the most popular collection of open source projects for defining infrastructure as code and enforcing system configurations, Open Source Puppet is great for individuals managing a small set of servers. But when you have complex or large infrastructure that's used and managed by different teams, Puppet Enterprise is the way to go. Puppet Enterprise is more than just a pre-built assembly of Puppet's core open source projects. Puppet Enterprise has additional powerful capabilities you can tap right out of the box to automate delivery and operation of enterprise-scale infrastructure, securely and with full reporting. These capabilities Orchestration, role-based access control, full portability, reporting and compliance Allow you to automate an entire application stack, and every element of your data center and cloud infrastructure. To know more about Puppet Enterprise and open source versions go to this URL and choose the right option for you. Ok, so let's review why you need Puppet Enterprise. Puppet Enterprise gives you graphical reporting so you can visualize your infrastructure, collaborate and respond to changes faster. You get real-time visibility into the effects of changes so you can see exactly what's going on in your infrastructure, and prove to executives and auditors that your organization is operating in compliance. Puppet Enterprise is built for distributed teams. It provides a standardized way to automate delivery and operation of your software. You get efficiency and traceability across large fleets of servers, plus the ability to safely delegate access across teams, view audit trails, and quickly orchestrate change across tens of thousands of machines. Puppet Enterprise lets you deliver value to your organization quickly. Whether your infrastructure spans hundreds or tens of thousands of nodes, Puppet Enterprise scales easily to give you performance monitoring resiliency and high availability. So you can roll out automation across your entire enterprise with full confidence. Puppet Enterprise gives you a consistent approach to automation across your entire infrastructure lifecycle, from initial provisioning to system configuration, application deployment, and intelligent change orchestration. Because Puppet Enterprise manages the breadth of your heterogeneous infrastructure, you can automate the entire application stack, from core infrastructure through middleware and application deployment. Deliver business value to your organization faster with support, services and training when you need it. You'll get a private support portal with email and phone support, immediate access to all product updates, an account manager to help you find what you need, puppet training, and help to quickly deploy, Develop and efficiently maintain your infrastructure using Puppet. Puppet Enterprise, P, is made up of various components and services including the Master of Masters and Compile Masters, the Puppet Agent, Console Services, Code Manager and R10K, Orchestration Services, and Databases. The Puppet Master is the central hub of activity and process in Puppet Enterprise. This is where code is compiled to create agent catalogs, and where SSL certificates are verified and signed. P infrastructure components are installed on a single node, the master. The Puppet master operates as the server for various clients, including Windows and Linux machines, network devices, or cloud VMs. With Puppet, you can manage almost any type of OS with the same master. Managed nodes run the Puppet Agent application, usually as a background service. Agent Nodes retrieves the client configuration from the Puppet Master and applies it to the local host. Periodically, the agent sends fax to a master and requests a catalog. The master compiles the catalog using several sources of information, and returns the catalog to the agent. Once it receives a catalog, 
The agent applies it by checking each resource the catalog describes. If it finds any resources that are not in their desired state, it will make any changes necessary to correct them. After applying the catalog, the agent submits a report to its master. Reports from all the agents are stored in PuppetDB and can be accessed in the console. A Puppet agent could be installed on physical servers, on virtual servers, or containers, or could be a network device. On top of servers it manages different operating systems like Red Hat, SUSE, Windows, Ubuntu and many other operating systems. Puppet agent nodes and puppet masters communicate by HTTPS with client verification. The puppet master provides an HTTP interface with various endpoints available. When requesting or submitting anything to the master, the agent makes an HTTPS request to one of those endpoints. When the puppet agent software runs for the first time on any puppet node, it generates a certificate and sends the certificate signing request to the puppet master. Before the puppet server is able to communicate and control the agent nodes, it must sign that particular agent node's certificate. You can use the puppet server CA command to inspect requests and sign new certificates. And agents can then download the signed certificates. Whenever the agent pulls the master for configuration updates, it only receives updates if its certificate is valid. So the agent will get the catalog for desired state only if agent is having a valid certificate. Ok, so in this section we learned about the Puppet Enterprise. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have time feel free to move on to next lecture to set up your lab.